Hey everyone, how's it going? My name is Hiftaker and I'm sorry I kind of like I shaved my head. I actually didn't know liking the hair on my head all over. So, you know, I shaved my head. But in this video today, I'm gonna show you how I made $12,500 selling t-shirts on Tree Spring. And my niche is actually COVID-19. It's a t-shirt about COVID-19. So here is the design that I made. It's, uh, it's like I survived COVID-19 and I was selling this for $19.99 so if I look at my uh, analytics uh, active is like 620 products has been sold and the profit is $12,500 so I'm gonna show you how to create the design for your shirts today uh, I'm not gonna talk about how to market and all this stuff but this is for the next video that I'm gonna uh, teach you but today I'm gonna only show you how you can uh, create a really really good design t-shirt and so I actually marketed this product only for the US customers but I saw one or two sales from the Europe but again we're not gonna talk about marketing and stuff today we're only gonna talk about uh, how you can create a really really good design so First of all, uh, we're gonna open the Photoshop, sorry. So we're gonna open the Photoshop. I'm actually using Photoshop, uh, I don't know what version this is, probably 2019 or something. The fuck cares? Who cares, sorry. So it's opening actually. And, all right. why so I'm gonna create a new new document so this document will be uh, 4500 wide and then the height will be 5400 pixel so this is the best one that actually I recommend uh, so the background contents will be transparent and after after getting this kind of uh, canvas, what we're going to do, we're gonna go to Google Chrome and we're gonna type this uh, website called PNG Press. Uh, uh, so after going to the Google, we're gonna we're gonna do a search about a, a website called PNGPress.com. Oh, sorry, PNGPress.com. So this website actually has like. Uh, designs that you can use for your t-shirts and everything so we're gonna go and we're gonna uh, write corona virus oh there's actually a lot of designs Oh, th this 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 design is actually really good for children. It's really good, but this one's good too. Mm -hmm. But today we're gonna go for really. So why I'm recommending this website is because of one reason. They their content is actually licensed under Creative Commons 4.0. So I'm a law student. And I know that if you put contents that you don't own, uh, you might really, really get in trouble. Uh, you might get uh, somebody else gonna sue you. Like if you put something like a Disney type of character or keyword or something from Disney without their permission, you'll get sued. And trust me guys, it's not worth it. So try to find contents that, that are like for the public use, you know, so that you can actually make money from it so uh we're gonna we're gonna just gonna use this kind of website but if you look around you will see a lot of websites like this so i'm gonna click download here so it's gonna download and uh, we are done so after downloading this what i'm gonna oh this so one of one of the thing is that this website has a really really good quality uh, images like PNG images. Their PNG images are really really good. So this one is like 1.5 megabytes or something. That's a really high for a PNG image. Trust me. 
So we're just gonna drag and drop this uh, on the PNG one and shift. Oh, sorry. Oops. Okay. So we're gonna click on shift and make sure that it's it's perfectly right. Hmm. Why is all right. So we can just put it right here or something and let's give it like some text. So we're not like gonna create really, really good type of design, but a design that people actually like and uh, the message gets spread. That's what we are go all gonna do to get our message spread, you know? So we can we can write something like, we are in this together and put this on the red color because the thing is red. So I have downloaded a couple of forms. You can uh, Google about really good forms and install those on your computer. So this one is like uh, this, you, you, you'll you see. So the uh, just gonna, what do you think we are in this? Yep, there you go. Voila. Uh huh. And let's put the virus sign a little bit uh, down so that it's. And yeah, there you go. Another thing is we need we can we can make this one more bold type of thing. So we're just gonna click on here. I think oh, edit layer type. I forgot how you can change this one. Maybe this. Um, oh, there you go. If you right click on the on the text button, you will see an option called the blending options. You open your blend option and you look for stroke, right? And you click on stroke. You see there, you, you'll see a stroke right there. So we can actually, you know, hide the, the thing like this a little bit. Mm, it looks much better now. And make this a selection type of thing. All right. So we're just gonna put this just make sure that you know everything's uh sound looks like you know kind of professional but the message is out there it's like we are in this together the coronavirus type of thing and and then we're gonna save this one actually uh control shift plus s so in that way we can actually see where we are saving this one so we're gonna save this as a png file because if you save this as a jp J, jpg it's not gonna it's not gonna work for the t-shirt design so just you know write something down and click on save all right so we're gonna go to the teespring again and then we're gonna click on start designing So choose your product. I always go for the t-shirts, but there's like tons of products you can create with Teespring. It's just your, you know, imagination or your choice, whatever. Uh, so unisex men t-shirt, classic tees. Do you want to sell or do you want to buy? Do you will put the option sell all the time. So I'm going to add the image. Uh, where is my download button? Yep, there you go. It's on the front, okay? Okay, so an another point of thing, make sure that your image and the, the, and the color of the shirt matches really, really good. So this is like white shirt, and we're gonna see what kind of other color t-shirts work with this uh, design as well. So let's go for the, uh, the silver or kind of like a gray type of color. I think the black one works good. Mm, that looks good. How about purple? Purple doesn't look good. This color is called, I think, royal blue. You can also use this one. This one actually looks good. Uh, 
you know make a comment what kind of color actually goes with this kind of uh, design uh, I'm gonna show you a really um, good website that you can see what kind of color goes with other colors it's called fact color UI I've been using this uh, website since 2013 this is really good actually it actually shows you what like it, it gives kind of like a really good idea like here it's flat UI palette American palette like what kind of colors Americans like Aussie what kind of people sorry what kind of colors Australian like British people like Canadian people like Chinese palette Dutch palette Ooh, this is actually really good so let's look at the Dutch palette right so here we can see that uh, let's say your design is actually this color so the best way it goes with this co color t-shirts or this color t-shirts which is actually by the way royal blue that we have here you see it kind of matches so what we're doing is we're putting red in front of royal blue which is kind of like a you know working and not working at the same time but you know so this is only for the design and education purposes but you know write the comment section if you have more ideas about how the color matching works uh, I always appreciate when people, you know, when we sh all share uh, our knowledges together. So here we're going to set our prices. I always go for the $19.99 price tag. $19.99 says, I don't know why, but it just makes me really, it just, it just feels better, you know. Also with the uh, Europe thing, $19.99 girl. $19.99. So we're going to put continue and that's it. So so what it is doing right now is it's kind of like uploading the design on other uh, designs. So what kind of name we can give? So let's say we are giving this Corona virus. No, let's put this. We are in this together. Uh, for the description, we're going to put grab one before it finish something like that so so right now it's publishing the design so what happened is that when someone orders in their website you will get a profit and they will get the shipment of your product that's it so it's like a fulfillment type of business yep so we got three colors of our t-shirts royal blue gray and the white so I'm pretty, I'm hoping that the white one sells better, but who knows, maybe the royal blue. You know, sometimes I put all the uh, all the colors together because I know, you know, different kind of people want different kind of results, different kind of colors. So it's their own choice. So, you know, let's, let's them be. So guys, this is the way that I get my designs and everything. So to, you know, have a mpop, uh, pngpress.com. So the website is called pngpress.com. You get the designs from there because they have because the, uh, their content. So this website is called the pngpress.com. They have the designs there, uh, which are publicly available. You don't need to pay anything to anyone. Just grab your design from there. See the color palette, what kind of design goes with what kind of shirts and everything, and make your design in in the Photoshop. And that's it. So subs click on the subscribe button if I get, you know, and the likes button. If I get enough, I will uh, create another videos about how you can market this. Where's the, what kind of the people are going to buy and where, where you can actually find the people. So all my sales are actually organic. So I'm not doing any kind of uh, Facebook promotions or anything because I don't want to spend money on Facebook. It's always like, I don't, I don't actually, I would like to, but I don't want to, if that makes any sense. <laughs> So I will see you guys for the next video. Have a great day and stay safe. Thank you.